welcome to con related excel practical section in this section we are going to be practice the count function in excel you can see here this is the sanir co private limited employees details and the first column is a contained the serial number the second column is contained the employees name then the third column is contained the gender the fourth column is contained the age the fifth column is contained the employees working branch the sixth column is contained the employees department of working place and uh, the seventh column is contained the employees nationality so this is all are related with the sanico private limiter employees detail i have uh, created uh, two sheets the first one is count related introduction the second sheet is contained the practical section now we are in the practical section so this is the requirement they need i mean the managerial people needed details needed and we need to be used this function right the managerial people requested these questions so we are going to be answer it it means that the first question for the managerial people is total number of employees total number of employees and uh, count empty cells and then total male employees total marketing staff total accounting staff total human resource staff and age below 30 employees number of accounting and south province working employees the this one is number of marketing and uh, western province employees number or uh, the this one is number of employees who are working in the eastern province with human research department this one is number of employees who are working in the accounting south province and sri lanka nationality this last one is the managerial people need the number of people who are working in the human resource section in the west province female right so these are the number of people they need and we are going to be get the details based on our count related functions right so the first one is the total number of employees if you want to be get the total number of employees based on the numerical value we can use the count function right if you want to be get that total number of employees based on the taxed value we can use the count a functions right so how can i get it we can get it by using count and count a function for an example total number of employees based on the numerical value i'm going to be count the first i need to put that equal sign then i need to call the count function then start the bracket then we need to be select the range so i'm going to be choose the numerical value because if i use the count function we have to be choose the numerical value so I'm going to be choose it there are 20 employees are working so I'm going to be close the bracket and enter you can see there are 20 employees are working if I delete one uh, serial number it will reduce because the count function never consider the empty cells right so for an example I'm going to be delete this uh, numerical values if I delete you can see 19 because the count function did not count the empty cells so this is the count function the second is we are going to be count based on the text uh, text value i mean here is the text this is the text this is the text so we are going to be count based on this tax value so if you want to be count the based on the tax value we can use the count here function right so i'm going to be choose that count a function for count the people based on the employee's name because employee's name it's a text value right so first i need to put that equal sign then i need to call the count a function count a function a function start the bracket then select the tax range so i'm going to be select the tax range you can see here and then close the bracket then enter 
you can see the total number of employees based on the tax value we count that as 20 right so if I delete one person for an example the first person I'm going to be delete if I delete what will happen it will reduce because count a functions also not count the empty cells I'm going to be delete you can see 19 right now because the count a function did not count the empty cells right so I'm going to be type H A F I L A half a lot right now is correct the third is details needed count blank cell so if you want to be count the empty cell there is no empty cells right so if you want to be count the empty cells we can use the count blank functions right now we are going to be count the blank cell in this range so based on the employee's name i'm going to be count so i'm going to be put that equal sign then i need to call the count blank function and I start the bracket and to select the range you can see there is no any empty cells right you can see there is no empty cells so it will come zero right you can see the count empty cells is zero but if I delete one a person it will increase I mean if I delete you can see the count empty cells is one right because I deleted one person and here also I'm going to be delete if I delete the empty cells it will increase it will increase because the count blank function count the blank cells so I'm going to put that Ali here here is Hafilla right 